My name is JP McMahon and I'm a chef and a restaurateur in Galway, Ireland. I think Irish food is uh, quite poorly represented internationally. I think there's a lot of cookbooks on Irish food in the, in the last um, couple of decades. But I think internationally the reception of Irish food often has a tendency to be stereotyped. And for me, running a restaurant um, over the last 10 years that uh, really sought out and specialised in Irish ingredients, I thought there was, a, I suppose, a, a time for um, a reassessment of, of Irish food and um, I think hopefully the Irish cookbook does that. I think we take for granted, um, with, I suppose we're in an era of uh, globalisation and we take for granted that we can have every ingredient all of the time and what we've been doing in, in an era in, in our, our restaurant in Galway over the last 10 years is really trying to limit ourselves to local products, to uh, products that we can uh, that we can grow in Ireland. It's it's difficult, particularly in the winter. You have to, I suppose, plan ahead and use a lot of different methods of preservation. But I think in the long run, it makes you more creative and it makes you think about the ways in which we, I suppose, procure different products. So it's very, very important. I think probably integrity. I think finding what you want to do and then and then pursuing that. I think often in in this climate, it's very easy to jump from. Uh, from ship to ship and I think tr trying to find your own uh, corner and and really work on that and and to feel confident in that I think that's what you need to do and if it takes one year three years five years I think over the last 12 years that's what we've been doing in 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 different ways but the same the same ethos about working with local farmers uh, refining our product and that's what I suppose I would I would say to any of the chefs today I think always to think outside the box and I think everyone has a uh, different pastimes and different pursuits and even though you're a chef you have many many other activities which drive you and I think it's important to consider those activities as well as uh, as being a chef and to try and fold them into your life because that's what I think gives you uh, uniqueness or an individuality in the kitchen.